Hey guys, how are you? We are reviewing the Chateau Clock, Baron Edmund de Rothschild, 2016. Guys, as you know from my previous videos, I am not a French fan. French wines usually need to be aged for a while, and they're very young to drink in 2016. I was advised that this should decant for at least six hours. This has been decanted for about six hours. I teased a little bit a few hours ago. Anyways, we're trying it again. Chaim, guys, again, I'm not a French fan, but there are a lot of people that like French wines. Everybody's palate is different. Let's say, for example, cream malaga. A lot of people don't like cream malaga. You tell any wine person, oh, cream malaga, they'll be like, what? The? But you know what? It's one of the best selling wines out there. Everybody likes different things, right? Sardine companies that make a lot of money, but not everybody likes sardines. <sighs> Very French. What does French mean for the layman's terms? Not that fruity, not that smooth. It's for me. Big wine people, oh, French wine, Bordeaux. Oh, wow. Anyways, let's try this out. Nice wine, smooth. A lot of tannins. Again, this happens to be a bottle that a lot of people like. It's one of the most popular French wines. I'm not a fan, but if someone has it and it's in front of me, I'm not gonna spill it out. Guys, Chag Sameach. Part two of review on Chateau Clark. So yesterday, I wasn't crazy about the wine. When I did the first review, I poured it into a water bottle to keep it fresh. Thought maybe I'll have someone to give it to. Today, I bring it over to a friend's house. We had it. I could so see what people are talking about now, that they like French wines. It was so refined, so perfectly balanced, so elegant. It was really, really perfect. Not as fruity as I like it, but I'm on the journey to learn more about French wines. And one of the reasons why I'm not so into French wine, well, because when you get a bottle from the store, it needs years. They're very, very young and they need a lot of time to really breathe and air out. And usually I just like to drink and pour. A lot of the Israeli wines are more drink and pour, maybe one to two hours decanting. Anyways, I'm going for another French wine on my next review. Check it out for the Leovo Poffin Saint Julien 2012. It's a little bit of an older wine. They're up to 2015 right now. This three year old older wine. And I'm going to let it sit for about five, six hours. And I'm going to taste it the next day also. With a lot of wines, keep this in mind. You have wine, you know, if you have some leftover wine, keep it for the next day, try it the next day. Lots of times, you'll be so surprised. It's a totally different wine. Thanks for watching.